my hair is crazy but anyways <laughs> when i start this with a rant i legit have three ediv packages or four well three ediv packages and two three other packages six packages uh four or maybe five of them should have been here this is saturday either thursday friday or today and i received none I've been having the worst luck with sending packages and people like not getting things for extra days than usual or now I'm, you know, and this has been going on like all summer. I'm just so over the post office. I am over it. We constantly pay more money to send things, but yet they don't do the job properly. So I'm just really irritated because... I've been having, I've been keeping some of this stuff on my desk because I wanted to get in those things to do a huge haul. And this isn't going to be a huge haul, but I can't stand this stuff on my desk anymore. So <laughs> I'm not going to get most of it to Tuesday or Wednesday. Today, Saturday, there's no way. So first thing is an e dig haul. I swapped for the Tarte Maracuja oil. I love this stuff. I am so happy to get this back. Also swapped for the Fresh Sugar Rose. I had a regular plain one before and I absolutely loved it. It was my favorite lip balm I ever used. And I also got the Marvelous Moxie Speak Your Mind lipstick. I'm kind of on the fence about this. Um, but it is pretty. So we shall see. And then she gave me some freebies. This is so awesome. Vita Coco coconut oil so i'm going to use this in my hair really excited i also gave me this jordana easy liner in this teal color which is so cool and then also giorgio armani fluid sheer sample that's cool then um a store by my house was going out of business so everything went 80 percent i thought it was going to go 90 but whatever so I picked up a few beauty things. I had went on Wednesday and there was a lot left and it was only 60% off and it was closing on Friday. So I happened to be in the area before a week on yesterday and I went in like all this stuff that I should have bought, like the It's a 10 stuff. You know, obviously it was all gone, but I did pick up the Tresemme Renewal Hair and Sculpt with Tea Tree Extract and Sunflower Seed Oil. Um, this is a conditioning mask. You guys know I love those. I have long thick hair that needs to be conditioned often and it's you know dyed constantly so um i think i got this for like a dollar 20 maybe then i figured i'd try this it's the l'oreal color vibrancy dual protect spray antioxidant uv filters this smells amazing like that's probably why i bought it because it just is something I want in my hair <laughs> and I thought this was interesting I've always kind of wanted to try this and I think I paid I'm trying to think maybe a dollar fifty for this I don't even remember and then I got this strawberry melon shave in the shower gel ultra smooth no run formula uh, thing and this was a dollar and you could always use shave gels. Like if I, if there was a way I could get shave gels for cheap, the other day I put it away. But I also bought a Gillette, my favorite, the Gillette, uh, not the Touch of Oil, but this one called Floral Rain. Never heard of it before. I got that for a dollar twenty-five or something, the full size. So that was awesome. I went into Ulta and I just picked up two things from the clearance. Both Montego Genie's The Body Smoothies. I've been curious about these, so I thought it would be fun to try. So I got the Acai and the Goji Berry. So there's quite a bit in there, and I think you might be able to get a few uses. I paid 99 cents each. So that was just kind of a pick-me-up before uh, a week yesterday and those things. And then today I went to the outlets, and all I bought is this. But it is the Urban Decay anti-aging eyeshadow primer potion the mini so they were selling these for 650 and it was 25 percent off all uh until tuesday i think what the heck i don't know so i paid five dollars so it was half off um and all i have is the tiny state on stray and that's not gonna last much longer 
because I've been wearing makeup every day. So I need it. So this is the example of why inventorying your stuff. Um, I have to update it with some of the things I'm showing you here. Um, is important because, oh, this is a $12 retail that I got for five. So I saved 60%, I think, right? Uh, no, this is a good example of why you inventory your makeup. Uh, because I knew I had nothing else, you know, and it's just a good example of actually buying something that I needed for once. Crazy. <laughs> so anyways, I have three swaps coming with some fun stuff in it and two shirts from eBay because like I'm building my thing. Oh, and uh, something from ThreadUp, which is clothing. And yeah. So, I will talk to you guys later. Bye.